what's good with it. So, here we are. Is this recording? Oh, the red light's on. Ha! <laughs> okay, that shit happens. I'm in, we're in broad daylight. Um, here we are. So, anyway, this is what's going on today. <laughs> Doug is going to have a treat meal in the car. And uh, I have my lovely wife with me. She says hi. While she's here, I'm going to go ahead and give her a shout out. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is the reason I was able to do those fucking, all those videos in the month and all the reason I'm able to do anything with my life after. Because she takes care of everything for me and I'm kind of a worthless husband. Oh, you're uh, <laughs> And I'm kind of, I'm not going to say I'm a shitty husband. I'm not going to say that. I'm going to say I'm a worth, like, to a point, like, I'm kind of, okay, useless to a point. Uh, you're not It's more like it. But, so, we thank you. We love you. Thanks for everything you do. So, I'm going to show you what I got and then, you know, I got to taste test everything because this is what we do. First off, we have a Krispy Kreme donut. Specifically, cake batter donut. These are fucking great. One of the best sources they have. Excluding the uh, glazed lemon filled one. We have a Wendy's pretzel baconator. Just double stack, not triple. I didn't even know they made a triple. She asked me, she, do I want single, double, or triple? I'm like, huh? I looked at it like I was stupid. I was like, a, a what? A triple? I was like, I said, you know what? I don't want the double. I want the double. So we got the double. And then this, honestly, I'm not going to lie to y'all. This is kind of a joke to me. This is kind of a fucking joke to me. This is a lar large, large, red velvet cake blizzard. This ain't no fucking large, by the way. Compare it to a water bottle size. like. Yeah, this ain't, this ain't no fucking large, guys. Like, American ice cream down the street from where we live gives you a fucking 32-ounce banger full of ice cream. I'm not joking. It's fucking full of top of ice cream. So... Thank you do a spoon, right? Uh, yes, yeah, in there. Okay, so this is what we're, this is what we're twerking with. I've never had one of these, by the way. So this is that's why it was intriguing. It's pretty big. That's oh, what they didn't she give said. you no napkins, did they? I got napkins for the uh, for the DQ. Okay. Well, yeah. So this is very intriguing. I've never had one of these. So let's pull this out and see what we're working with. Okay. Double, nice, not bad. Ooh, that pretzel, pretzel bun. Oh my good. god. What an absolute clapper, bro. Oh, put the herb back. Hold on, oh my god, put the herb back. <laughs> I gotta tuck the herb behind my... Ooh, hold on, hold on. I don't even know what's on here. So we got two patties, cheese, bacon. Uh, Probably like I'm not mustard. Really no, it mustard. looks like mayonnaise and ketchup. Mayo and ketchup. Yum, that's my solid, favorite combo. Solid, solid. Um, napkins there, I already got hair fucked up. All right, let's give it that a little, um, little taste tester. We gotta get some bacon in there. That looks good. Yo, she's feeding, bro. Just so y'all know, I offered to get her whatever she wanted. Oh, also, this whole venture cost roughly $20.50. So, um, it's fine. I worked overtime today. <laughs> okay. I love a pretzel bun, though. I hit me. That's pretty fucking good. To be honest, I don't want to taste the pretzel bun, though. Oh, that's disappointing. It needed some sprinkle of salt on the top. I'm gonna choke, bro. It's dry. It's dry. The bun is dry. Pretzel is kind of dense. <laughs> Pretzel though. and meat are dry as fuck. Yeah. <laughs> bro, I almost died. Who do you need to drink? No point me like that. Okay. Damn. I need to drink, bro. Grease is literally about to drip off me, yo. That's, that's the sign a of a good burger. Bro. You wanna over, bite? Over here choking on your meat. Oh. You wanna bite? I know she wanna bite. Yeah. Here you go. Hey, sharing is caring, ladies and gentlemen. Gotta love a bite. Get that bite. Mm, bite that motherfucker. Bite like a pit bull. <laughs> so good. <laughs> motherfucker hard, though. I don't know if y'all can hear that. I'm talking with my mouth full. Excuse me. When I bit that bit, just grease is fucking out of the burgers, bro. Like waves cushion. That's not, that is so good. <clears throat> Meat's a little dry, though. That hurts the esophagus. I got a bite with a lot of mayonnaise and ketchup, so I mine was fine. Yeah, that that, that hurt the esophagus. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. It's easy to bite with no bread. Like I just took that bite. It's easy to bite with no bread. Yeah, the bun's not super pretzely. Yeah. Nothing wrong. I'm halfway through and it's a good ass sandwich, I'm not gonna lie to you. With that pretzel bun is 
You gotta kind of chew a little bit, work up a little saliva. Like, I'm not gonna lie to you. All I had to do was think of pie and my salivary glands in the breast. Definitely gotta work up a little saliva. I'm not, I'm not joking. They, they need to put like a, like a honey butter like on, on the outside of it or something. Make it a little bit moister. Soften up that pretzel. That's a good idea. Sprinkle of salt. That's genius though, actually. Because softening up that bun would make it so much easier to go down. But very quality sandwich. That's, I all wouldn't be weird, bro. <laughs> You're, the sauce doesn't drip off the outside. That's going to be a quality bite. I had that. Yeah, that bite that I had was good. But I don't think I could eat the, like, I could eat the double, but like, but like my stomach can handle it. But like, it's just, uh, I feel like it, I'd need more ketchup and mayonnaise on there or something. Yeah, I probably should have with a mayo pack or something. I am hot. I do love mayo. But, uh. Um, I'm not really sure. I think the calorie count on this is like a thousand calories, or roughly, so not bad. It's one sandwich, not bad, bro. <laughs> it's most people's, like, most of their entire day. Of course, the majority of people that eat, like, or drink, like, Starbucks drinks. I like seven, eight hundred calories in one of those drinks. When you think about it, how much more pleasure could you get out of a burger like that instead of, like, a fucking caramel macchiato, whatever the fuck, you know? I like Wendy's burgers because they're like smash burgers. You know what I mean? Like they, oh, that's a lot of grease coming off. That's so well. That whole, look, that whole bite is just, it looks like a glazed donut. That's how much Wrong. grease is on there. That's why I got more napkins out for you. I'm just soaked in grease. Don't get it twisted though. It's good. Yeah, it's good. I'm just soaked in grease. But yeah, I feel like Wendy's burgers, they like smash them. They like do like a smash burger thing. Steak and Shake's like that too, though. I do not like Steak and Shake. I like Steak and Shake. I think we've only gone there once together. <laughs> bro, you need like a beach towel to like. <laughs> I'm glazing up, bro. I can't sweat because I have so much grease on my hands. I'm glazing up. Maybe back to finish though. It's so much grease. Should have brought the tomes with me. These people are arguing over here in the Wendy's parking lot. We'll be all right. Okay. Last bite. Can you give me a napkin, please? <clears throat> I did not know that that was going to be that greasy. I'm not joking. That's insanely greasy. Like, right. just covered in... My whole hand's so slick. What's the rating on Big Debra? Big Wendy. So, cost ratio... I paid about ten dollars for that burger. Ten and some change. It was ten dollars for that burger. See, there it is. Freaked out. No, I'm just kidding. Um, so about ten bucks that burger. Cost, taste, time I waited. Given all that factor, honestly, is about a six and a half, seven out of ten. It's funny because ten minutes later, nobody's waiting, but they were wrapped around the building. Taste now. Taste alone is at least an eight to me. To be oh, honest. Oh yeah. Taste alone is an eight. I like a little more ketchup, a little more mayo. But man, that shit was good. Yeah, let's open your teeth first. Where is that? Get it. I got burger in my teeth. All right. One of my favorites. It's a little old though. I can see it's old, but it's okay. Cake, sprinkles. cake batter donut. Got the sprinkles on there. Got the cake batter filling. This is going to be. That's a quality donut. So let me get that. Let me get that bitey bite. Show them the inside. Oh, well, nuts. I got the sprinkle. Cake batter. Sorry. Donut, I, I don't. Donut, I think it was maybe two. This was like two fifty, two yeah, seventy five, something yeah. like. You get it's a better deal the more you buy. You buy like a dozen, yeah. Because whenever I here. This, I'm so messy. Because whenever I bought them for my um for my class for uh. Christmas time, it was like fourteen dollars for like, uh, and I can and I made like a We're custom. Sort of dozen. My phone just fell uh, out. Yeah, a custom dozen. So yeah, this is like two fifty or two seventy five. But you get it so much better if you buy twelve. Like I'm not joking. They had a Valentine's Day menu. Did you see it when we went through the drive thru A lot of them were like strawberry. Mm, I didn't chocolate see it. strawberry, yeah. And that cream dripping. Okay. I'm not joking. The cream is dripping out of it. Great donut, though. This is one of my favorites. Damn it. Keep dropping sprinkles. 
My other favorite is that iced um, lemon filled. Ugh. That is that is an all time clapper, bro. I'm gonna be honest though. I got a strawberry one whenever my students got them, and it was pretty good too. Strawberry filled? No, it was just like a regular like glazed donut, but it had strawberry icing on the top instead of like the regular glaze, and it was. Good Sorry, too. I'm extremely messy. This is not the plan, but this is what we got. This isn't exactly. This is like my street meal that I wanted, but like. It's this is a very quality meal, but um, I just choose I chose to get different stuff because honestly, I just wanted different stuff. Like I could have went to all one restaurant, or whatever, and they only got the one stuff I wanted. But like, so many places around this time come out with like so much different stuff, and I'm like, I gotta try it. So, I saw. That I fucking it. love red velvet. By the way, holy fuck, I love red velvet. Everything, red what? velvet, red velvet Oreos, everything. So. It's really hard to tip this to see what you can. S I'm trying to like not tip this shit out. You just took a bite out of this. Like but if you took it out. You took a bite out of crime. Yeah. Gong gong. That was a big piece of red velvet there, though. I saw this on an advertisement last week whenever I was coming home from work, and I told him. <laughs> and I told him that Bro. he had it. And he was like, "Why did you tell me that?" Bro, okay. This shit is good as fuck. Red velvet's so fucking, it's my favorite flavor of almost anything besides blueberry, but you know. Mmm. High quality. I won't finish all this on camera. It's gonna be really weird for y'all just sit and watch me eat a blizzard. <laughs> That'd be really weird for that to happen, so. Isn't that what they call a mukbang? I'm just eating like everything and just stuffing yourself to ungodly fool. Oh. I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys. Is that burger and that donut? I will finish off the rest of this blizzard. Uh, I'm probably still gonna be hungry, but like this, that's more than enough for me. This is more than enough calories for me. I don't need any more. Like, damn, this shit's good. So, is it like piece of red velvet cake in there? Then is there also hell like, yeah a cream cheese? Anything in there? I don't know, but icing is typically. I don't know. Like this shit's good. Hmm. Mm. Only reason I'm mad, like I said, because we were explaining this, they're large isn't a large, bro. This is like a medium at best. Wow. They fucked the game up with this one. It said it was back, so that means they must have had it before, like as a seasonal item. I've never, never I've it. really never had it before. Want back? No. I don't think she likes red velvet cake stuff. It's too sweet. It ain't sweet enough. I don't think she's a fan of red velvet. No, not really. I'm not a big cake person. Well, okay, so. As I can keep eating this shit. <clears throat> okay. So rating this, I'm gonna I'm gonna rate off a lot of different factors here. Size. This ain't no fucking large. So that's like a 2 out of 10. Taste. 9 out of 10. Price. I think this is $8. Or close to $8. So that's what I mean like for the $250 or $270 or whatever. The $10 burger and the $8 blizzard. <coughs> it was roughly around $20 $21 for all this. But Which by the way. The only thing going up. Like prices on everything is going up. You want to know what's not going up? My pay. So Same. there's that disclaimer. But for everything, I would say all in all, probably it's a solid blizzard. I love red velvet cake, so I'm gonna rate it higher. This is one of their better blizzards, me at least an 8.5 minimum, maybe a nine. But I get pissy with their larges because it's not a large. But this shit is good. You sure you don't want any? No. Mmm. Mmm mmm mmm. I'm telling you, they fucked the game up with this one. This is they did something with this. Damn. But okay, so <coughs> I, I think this is around twelve hundred calories. I'm not. Jo I'm not joking. I think this is around twelve hundred calories. So when I finish all this, meal consumed would be the double baconator, cake batter donut, and then a large. What the fuck that means? Blizzard from uh, red velvet cake blizzard from Dairy Queen. Um. So what I'm like I said, adding up the calories, it's roughly around yeah about twenty four, twenty five hundred calories. 
So, not bad. It's not really that filling of a meal. It's not going to be super heavy. The burger was the, I was the only thing I was worried about being super heavy. But I have watered it up almost all day. I had a little, I had a little breakfast, watered it up the rest of the day. I slammed a 16 ounce water before to help with digestion on this. I'm going to do another water after this. So I'm just trying to help you, you know, kind of water keeps it going. Don't, don't go out and slam like an energy drink or some chalky milk, fucking something like that. And just let this shit stir and brew in your stomach. Here's the other fucking kicker to this guys. I'm trying to get, drop some drop some gems, drop some knowledge real quick. When you eat all this, see we're going to stores afterwards. Please walk around. I'm not joking. This is going to help with digestion and everything. Please walk around. <coughs> Excuse me. Walk around, go to some stores, do something. Don't just sit on the couch. You're going to fucking hate your life. You're going to feel like shit. You're going to be miserable. Walk around, get some energy out, get some activity level up, you know, get around and you're going to be fine. But I'm going to finish this up, and I'm going to go ahead and end this video now and finish this up. We're going to head to stores. But that is my, this is my official, officiale, post-trade cheat meal that I really, treat meal, sorry, not cheat, treat meal that I really wanted. So, if this goes well, um, honestly, this might be a once a week thing on camera. Next time we'll have Jessica get food too, because she's been uh, dieting. She's just been really sick, and I feel really bad for her, and I really do. It's fine. I feel really bad. She's been so sick this last, literally in like a f the whole month. I'm not joking. She's been so fucking sick. Like, if she gets better, she doesn't get better. But hopefully, hopefully we're turning. I hope we're turning the corner. We're turning the corner. Uh, I really hope she gets better, and then next week she can join me for a meal of her choosing. And we can go to wherever she wants to. But uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I, I I love fucking eating and working out. This is literally what I do, and I do this shit for fun. Like I don't do this shit for anything other than fun. But I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope I'm bringing you more eating content also because, again, I just love this shit because, fuck, this is so good. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to let you go with that one. And uh, I hope everyone has a good day. What I tell y'all every time, drink that gallon of water, get that food, eat that protein. Please, get that protein. Kill your fucking workouts. <laughs> On top of that, above all else, sleep seven to nine hours a day and you're going to be fine. And we will catch you on the next one. Have a good day. See ya.